Greetings and welcome back everyone to Oolong Rise and of course to Rune World where there's apparently starvation. What? How? How are you starving? Rachel? Rachel, how are you starving? You're in the barn. The barn has access to the kibble. You're meant to be able to eat kibble. Uh, can you not eat kibble? Can you not eat the eggs? I, I, I mean, I know you will. Uh, all right. Uh, expand allowed area for the barn. Well, the barn has access. I have no idea. Why is Rachel not eating the kibble? That's the whole point of the kibble, is that it's uh, edible um, to all kinds of animals. Let's have a quick look. Car, uh, raw meat corpses. Oh, specifically raw meat or corpses. Vegetables, raw meat, corpses, seeds, animal products, meat, liquor, kibble. Ah, damn it. Okay. That is really quite bad. That is super, super high levels of badness there. What can we do? What can we do? Other than buying back a bunch of the animals we just sold. Which I will do if necessary, but honestly I don't think it is necessary. Unfortunately, we've got Pepe, Frankie, Mayhem. We've got Ophelia. Well, damn it. Okay, we need to change this then to also storing raw meat any type uh right well i'm a little bit surprised that the cows haven't bred yet their life expectancy is 22 so i mean i can only assume that they can i'm gonna feel terrible about this i really am but i may I can't see any animals outside to hunt. Alright, well, I could butcher some of our prisoners, but I'm not going to resort to that unless it is literally the last thing that we can do. I am, however, willing to resort to it if it is the last thing that we can do. Our animals are worth more to me than that. Um, this is just random prisoner. Oh man, it's going to cost me so much to get these back. <laughs> that is painful. Alright, well, there's nothing we can do. I need them all. Let's get them all. Thank you. Grabs are going to head back. Unfortunately, here's. This is not good for you. Hurry up. Slaughter them. Jaden. Prioritize. There we go. And the next one. And the next one. I know it's terrible. I realize this. But we super badly need them butchered. Uh, in fact, I'm going to add butchering animals to this but i'm only gonna ha well it's only restricted to uh, human like as well right Jaden, work there we go and more please and more no 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 uh butch ah scallywax all right, I need to adjust this quite a lot then. Let's pull this down by 250. In fact, let's pull it down to 1,000. That's more than we possibly need, but that's what we'll have. I would like you. Jaden, can I have you? Well, oh, there's nothing I can do there. That is a pain. I mean, ideally, I would like... There we go. Is she being fed a little bit? She at least... There we go. You are actually taking care of it now. Good, 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 good. 
However, we are going to have to start filling this up with, with things that she can eat. Uh, we have staved off the issue for the time being, but it is not going to be long before we're forced to deal with that in a more drastic way. Just as well, we got some prisoners, I guess, but that is going to be unfortunate. Well, um, I mean, th that's th that's the rough thing, is the Warg needs to have meat. I, I didn't realize that they wouldn't be able to eat kibble. That they, it is going to make things very, very difficult. Okay, well, first and foremost then, let's do what we said we'd do and install an artificial nose. Go ahead, Jack. Go rest until healed. Donk. Someone come and install an artificial nose, please. Isildur. Um, Jaden. No. Jaden. Bonk. Isildur. Go forth. Jaden, you're no longer drafted. There we are. Let's see if we can fix Jack's face. It's been a long while coming. Ooh, cargo pods. Wow. Perfect timing, cargo pods. Truly perfect timing. I approve. Did it work? Jack's got an artificial nose! Hooray! No one's going to hate him utterly because of how disfigured he is. I think. Um, and Zarakis? Uh, did you actually also lose a, a nose? No, you've just got a scar on your eye. I'll fix that eventually. But for now, Jack is no longer deformed and people don't hate him just because he lacks a nose. If that had carried on, I was going to have to give him a nickname. I'm not sure what nickname it would be. Or I might just start calling him Tyrion. That would also be suitable. Right, we've got a, a dead hair. Jaden, would you be able to... Oh, you can't do it now. Well, that's annoying. Alright. Is this set up to butcher creature? Yes. Uh, Isildur, where are you? Could you please butcher a creature? Let's get all of those out of the way. Battery's gone down. That's unfortunate. Okay, well, that is resolved. Now, the way that we're going to fix this area, though, that's going to be a little bit different. Let's actually get that installed for now. Uh, Jack can't do the work. Sorry, Jack. Um... Actually, or can Jack? Uh, first, I would actually really like Jack to work on the slate wall more than anything. I would very much like this not to be a massive gaping hole in our defenses, Jack. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Just having that done makes me feel so much better. Right, I would like this to be moved down there for me. Thank you. Now, that doesn't, it appear connect or anything. I also want it to be a white light as well. But I'm going to have to run some extra power, it seems, along the sides here, all the way up. Uh, that isn't too much of a problem, I don't think. We should be okay with that. And Oh, right. So this may be where a lot of our slate blocks have been going, is obviously the tiling around there. Right, I see. Uh, there we are. That is all good. I approve. Now up here we just want a couple of small some things. Limestone will do. I'm just going to place a little bit of limestone each of these corners and I'm hoping that is going to cause this to gain a roof because it'll technically seal off the area. We are additionally going to clear the no roof zone above these walls. There we are. Something like this. All the way along. And like so. Now I'm going to leave the sandbags considered outside for no particular reason other than I think it'll make the place seem a little bit more like it makes sense. There we are. But other than that, we should be good. Alright. Spring has begun. Lovely. How are you doing, Rambo? I think it's time that Rambo actually have an area set up for them. So let's manage areas, make a new one called Prison. There we are. And Rambo should be limited to the prison area. 
Now we need to make sure that the prison is set up correctly, and that includes all of the prison itself, obviously. The area for the freezer only the storage itself so that uh, Rambo can get some new clothes if needed also the recreation room and naturally the um, the hospital as well I'm probably going to want to move this Let me install this down here somewhere then we'll expand out the prison area just a little bit more as well just enough that Rambo can make use of the telescope that should make things nice for everyone, I think. Okay, I think we actually did reasonably well. Now then, let's have a look through everyone who's got any kind of injury. You've got a scar in your left eye. So we're, we're definitely going to need an eye. Uh, a left eye specific. Two left eyes. Alright. Three left eyes. Any more eyes? No, just three left eyes and one right lung. Okay, well, we don't have enough people for everyone to have all of the left eyes they need, but, you know. Uh, this might just be eye, in which case it's fine. Uh, let's remove... Left eye. And right lung. And, Koi, you will also have your left eye removed. And we'll see if these are just classed as eyes afterwards. There we go. This does feel rather rather barbarous, but... Uh, oh. Jack, could you haul the eyeball? Thank you very much. Oh, just popping out there. That is unfortunate, but it has shown me that we can go ahead and take out the right eye as well. Isildur, could you deal with that for me? Prioritize. Uh, Taken to operate. Yes. There we go. Excellent. Once that's done, we'll get a couple of things sorted out. Components assembly allows you to build the component assembly bench where colonists can make components from simple materials. Wonderful. Oh no, Jack has failed catastrophically while operating on one of our prisoners. Uh, we've got multi-barreled weapons. Uh, allows us to build miniguns. Not really that high a priority, I'll be honest with you. Surrogate organs, simple prosthetics, hydroponic shipbuilding basics, mortars. Um, simple prosthetics, I think. Let's start work on that now. Let's have a look at this new bench that we can make. The component bench. Component assembly bench. Oh, wow. That is rather large. We could build it down there if I really wanted to. I kind of do. We'd lose two beds, but uh, that's fine, honestly. Let's reinstall this over there. And then uninstall this one completely. Uninstall this completely and uninstall that completely as well. There we go. In fact, we're also going to uninstall this one. There we go. Uh, I'm going to just uninstall this and instead reinstall that one down there. Oh, really? Okay, cancel. Whatever. Let's get this one reinstalled down there instead. There we are. We'll go ahead and build the component assembly bench straight away if we can. Really love it if this wasn't just left outside to rot. Alright, let's have a look at you. <laughs> My god, Jack! Did you just... Were you just in a mood? I think you may have just been in a mood. Um, mind you, the same can be said about Isildur. Isildur didn't take that particularly good care. Right, okay, well, Zarekis, I would like to get you your left eye replaced. But it will mean taking the, the, the eye out first. Uh, this is potentially terribly bad. But... Oh no, we can just install the left eye. Okay, right, go rest until healed, please. 
Then we're going to get our best doctor to deal with you. Who I am fairly certain is Isildur with 14, Drek with 12. Oh, Drek's getting there. But yes, Isildur, prioritize operating on Zorakis, please. Go use that eye straight away. Best of luck, Zorakis. Please don't do something bad. Oh, uh, catastrophically failed. Okay, what do you do? You just cut everywhere. Isildur, you scoundrel, you. And you lost the eye. Uh, that was an important organ. We're not just going to be able to have a million eyes, you know. Or maybe we are, but damn it. This is why I waited so long to get the hospital built. Because even with the hospital, surgery is really dangerous, as, as you can see. It is by no means a guarantee. Rachel should be okay at this point with the food. Yeah, there we are. Very happy about that. Very, very happy about that. Okay, looks like Jack just took out the lung. Well done, Jack. Also, could you... Uh, well, someone is going to take care of that. Okay. Well. Hmm. <laughs> shall, shall we try? Okay, install the right lung. Go rest. Oh, it's going to be risky. Alright, Isildur. Isildur's going to take care of the lung surgery as well. Please don't kill Laura. There are lots of people in the colony who would be very unhappy with you. Did it work? <gasps> it worked! Fantastic! Well done, Isildur. You have redeemed yourself. Well done, indeed. Very, very happy with that outcome there. Okay. You have been fully healed. Excellent. Uh, you've got an artery blockage. Eh. Never mind. We're going to remove your other eye while you're still alive. Uh, remove right eye, please. Now, let's just have a look at people, because I'm fairly certain they're going to begin a little bit... Uh, someone's organs were harvested. Times two. Mm. Starts in six days, 18 hours. Finishes expiring in seven days, six hours. Uh, dare I do this? No, actually, I dare not. You're going to survive for a little while, because I do not want to stack up so many... Um, negative moodlets. We're going to let you be for a little while. Uh, this should not be a gathering spot. If it is, no it is not. That is good. This should not though. There we are. I don't want people gathering here. Thank you. Alright. Okay. Well. Let's make sure you're set up as a prison. Now, let's change Rambo's priorities on working. Right? You're not going to be handling any animals at this point. The reason for that is it's not part of your job anymore. You're a warden, and only a warden you shall be. You won't do any construction work, nor will you grow anything at all. You won't craft either, or research. You will, however... Um, you will clean. So the, f the first thing you'll do is you'll warden. If you can't do that, you'll repair. If you can't do that, you'll clean. If you can't do that, you'll haul. So Rambo should be fairly responsive to any hauling tasks, at least in the rooms that Rambo has access to. Okay, let's go ahead and construct for ourselves a component assembly bed. Just gonna wow, it takes a lot of steel. And there's nothing we can do about that. It, it flat out just takes as much steel as it's going to take. Uh, let's get you a wooden stool to sit on. And eventually we'll put some nice plant pots in here as well. Something to spruce the place up a bit with. Okay, not too bad. Now this area is completely sealed off. It is now classed as indoors. At this point we can go ahead and remove these walls. Now, the reason why I had to build it this way is that it has to be shown that it is an indoor area. The roof gets built. When I take the walls away, the roof should not necessarily be unbuilt. We'll have to see about that one. It may actually go away. But even if it's not classed as indoors, there is still a roof there, as you can see here from the shadow. I can get rid of that by uh, making it a no-roof zone. Pop like that. But... This should 
be okay. We'll see now. There. So everyone in here is fully dark. So even though it, I mean, it's considered dark over here. How about down in here? Everything around there is 60%. So we should be good. It'll be hard for our enemies to see us, but we'll be able to see out. Uh, I would actually, Jack, could you hold this for me? Thank you very much. This way, our dear Rachel can nom her food. There we go. Perfect. Very happy with that indeed. Alright, what else is going on at the moment? We've got some breakdowns. Nah, we can deal with that. It's not too much of a problem. Everything in there is going well. And generally, we are putting things back in order. I'm very, very pleased with that. Very pleased indeed. We've got a bunch of stuff outside that we still need to bring in though, which is kind of a pain. Um, Evelyn? Actually, you you won't be doing it. Berserakis? Go melee attack this. Alvin can come and join you as well, please. Let's get that iguana slain so that we can bring its food into the colony. There we go. Well done. Any others on the map? Is anything wandering around? I can see grasses swaying, but that's about it. There is a Mega Scarab over there, but I'd rather not just mess with a Mega Scarab if I don't have to. Right, could you take this with you, please? Go ahead and haul that in. Thank you very much. Right, sorted. Okay, well, I'm fairly happy with the progress we made. Finally, Jack is no longer so ugly that the only person who loves him is his mother. This is a good time for us, I feel. We've got our shooting gallery completely concealed in darkness, so uh, people are going to find that hard to deal with. And we are going to remove the suspension on breaking down metal slag into steel. We need the steel at this point, so we might as well. We've also got all the furniture inside, which is good. And generally, I am very happy with the outcomes there. Jack... How long is left on this? Uh, five days, 18 hours. We can last that long, I feel. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. But on that note, I'm going to wrap up this episode. In the next, we are probably going to be looking at uh, building a couple of more bedrooms so we can get the last uh, members of our colony out of the communal uh, sleeping area, out of the barracks, and we can maybe even look then to installing a billiards table. We will also perhaps look at setting up a wardrobe area so that I can just give everyone access to somewhere where they're going to get clothing but not necessarily the main stockpile area for our craft room. But that is it from me. So until next time, do take care everybody.